All right, guys, how's it going? It's still December, and for next year, my brother's gonna start working out with me. But I wanted to do a little something, something. I want to see and test out if my brother can do 105 pounds, I'm trying to pull down the bar. Let's see if we can do it. See, this is what we got right now, guys. <laughs> Look at this guy right here. So we're just gonna try to test his strength before we get to January. So Carlos, go ahead and sit down, facing this way. This is what I'm gonna train him for, to get him stronger. Cause this is what happens when you eat too many hot Cheetos, when you eat too many tacos. Oh, and it goes back up, all right. It's too much, it's like 105 pounds. It's okay, guys, it's okay. That's why you need a personal trainer. How's it going, guys? This is what today, like I said, the new year has started, and I'm gonna help my brother. Get in shape. So we're gonna see how much he weighs and then we're gonna go on from there. I'm gonna train him for maybe three to four months. We're gonna see where he's at. And let's check out his weight. 160 pounds. What's your height, Carlos? Like 5'3, 5'4? 5'3, 5'5. Alright. So we're gonna see, we're gonna see how much we can get him down. I'm gonna work this guy to the fullest. How do you feel about that, Carlos? I'm ready. Pop the scale. We're gonna try to get some uh, some shots. So go ahead and flex. You can tell that he's like pretty big, like he's got an upper big body, so now we just gotta put it to working out. Go ahead and turn to the side. Flex. Okay. Face the other way, face the curtains. Yeah, stay like that, stay straight. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, we're good. That's it, bro. You can cut it. Make sure what he wants out of it. So I'm gonna turn the camera to Carlos and I'm gonna ask him, Carlos, what is your goal? Well, my goal is to get back to normal weight. I weighed 160 pounds. I used to weigh like around 140, 135. I gained a lot of weight, so I need to lose it. Get back to normal. I don't like what I, I'm looking at. I'm 30 years old. So he weighs 160 pounds, he wants to get down to 140. We're gonna work on that, we gotta make it happen, all right? Let's get to it. So Carlos, pretty much, I want I want to start you with basic exercises so we can get you to start working your, your muscles, feel the tension. So we're gonna start with you with 10 pounds. Now, don't think about it as like, man, that is weak. It's not weak, it's to get you started, okay? So I'm just gonna go like this, hold it, okay? Hold it for at least two seconds. You feel like you can do another step? 
10 or not? Because I saw you taking a little bit of the left. So maybe we can drop it down to 7. We'll drop it down to 7. We'll just probably leave this one more set of this and then we'll switch it up. Two, one. Two, two. So yeah, we're pretty much trying to get him into the groove of exercising again. You always gotta start at the bottom, not at the top, because then the next day he's gonna be completely sore, completely worn out. So we're trying to build him up slowly, okay? Alright, for this next exercise, you're gonna be doing like a front raise. So you know how you do it on your side, now you're gonna do it at the front. Alright, and it's the same way, you just gotta hold it. Get your arms working, get warmed up. So try to try to stretch your arms, try to move them around. It's gonna be wide. Sponsored by Aquafina. Just kidding. It's not sponsored by. Do you focus like back straight? Like you feel it? Put your put your focus on your arm. Feel it on your delta. If you want to put your arm here just to one, two, balance, you, one, can, you can feel like you're balancing. One, two, one, two, three, one, four, one, two, five, one, two, six, seven. Like you're going this way, you gotta keep it straight. Maybe there's something wrong with your arm. You say you messed it up a while back? That's better, yeah. One, two, So right now we're just working on your arms, trying to get them warmed up. I'm pretty sure tomorrow you're going to feel sore. You know? That's where we're going to go to the next body. Maybe we're going to work on abs. And then the next day we'll work on legs. So every day you're working on something different. And we're trying to get them to warm up, stretch. Get them to wake up once again. Bring out that inner demon that's inside of this guy. This Nike sign. He's going to say, just do it. Just do it. Alright, let's get it. Come on.
extensions. You did some front raises. Pretty much working on your deltos. You already have big arms, so that's why it's kind of like you feel good, right, when you're doing it. You're just like working these muscles right here. <laughs> why do you guys look at me, man? <laughs> Damn it, cameraman. <clears throat> Laugh if you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> That rocky shit. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place, and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. You, me, or nobody is gonna hit as hard as life. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Now, if you know what you're worth, then go out and get what you're worth. But you gotta be willing to take the hits and not pointing fingers saying you ain't where you wanna be because of him or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you. You're better than that. busy for tomorrow so we decided to weigh him in for this month and we're gonna see where he's at so he's been working out with me every single day he's been doing what he's supposed to Carlos how do you feel right now since uh, your first month's workout training feel very good I feel like I think I lost my weight all right turn to the side and yeah, you can tell you kind of lost weight on the stomach all right show the back Got a lot of stretch marks. Nah, well, he just barely woke up, so that's why he has all those marks. Or maybe he had a bad nightmare and pretty cool came in. All right, you can tell he's been losing weight. He's looking stronger in the legs. All right, it's pretty nice. All right, let me get this at 160. All right, go ahead and get it top. Wow, 10 pounds. <laughs> 
Beautiful. <laughs> You were kind of right there by 150, so good job. You lost 10 pounds, sir. First month completed. Well, what do you want to say, coach? Just want to say we've done a good job so far. First month, uh, second month, it's going to be a little bit more uh, more improved, improving, you know. And getting on that treadmill, getting on some more minutes, more stronger workouts. 150, 150 pounds, flex. Yeah. So how do you feel about that? Losing 10 pounds in one month. It's about pounds, 10 pounds. Yeah, We're gonna good. go for more. All right, so there you go. Some more pounds. To 150, it's a big improvement right there. So the second month's gonna be a little bit more hectic. We're gonna go a little bit more stronger, more faster. So I appreciate everybody watching. Let's go to second. Yeah, Contessa, good evening from a frigid Dallas. And the concern right now are these rolling outages, these periodic blackouts that have been going into effect since early this morning. That leaves up to 2 million Texans without guaranteed warmth for what looks to be an incredibly frigid night ahead. As you mentioned, the entire state, for the first time in weather history, under that winter storm warning, we also had portions in West Texas that were under a blizzard warning. We reported early this morning Seven degrees. Guys, um, so this is my house. <laughs> I don't know what it is. House is flooded, the roof collapsed, there's no power. Oh my god, 40 hours, no power. It's freezing. It hasn't snowed here since 1973. Oh my god. <laughs> You're his son too, what do you mean? My blood, it's your blood, what do you mean? No, Carlos, it's okay. I've been through it before. Cuidado, like Mr. Carlos said, we're gonna follow standard protocol procedures. Trail 2000 has to deal with the, the Y2K crash. You remember about the Y2K crash? People almost lost it. They lost it all. But guess what? We made the Y2K grill. And since then on, this has represented My God. enlightenment. People's death is represented over a grill. Yes, sir. No, me llamé nada matando allá donde Juan no joda. Allá está la mayoría de hielo. Aquí no hay hielo. Allá, al otro lado, la gente lo anda recogiendo porque es un montón de hielo. Quirito salir a agarrarme, no, le digo, se mata. Mejor hay que hacer, le digo. Ay, a ver, y como uno no lo quiere ir a agarrar cuando llega. Y a ver, tiene que tener la cuenta, David. Qué suerte. Es que es de hombre, sí, es hombre. What? On each side, 50, and then the bar is 45. We got 95 pounds total. So she, she can touch those little fucking titties. Uh, uh, so I was saying when we're trying to build up his chest so he can build up them titties because they're really small. <laughs> we're trying to build a big chest, manly chest. So we gotta start somewhere, you know. It's got them A cups. We're trying to build them up to some B cups. 
you know, be the uh, or something like that. I'm trying to get something. Like that. Okay, okay. Five pounds, but you know, it's like his first time doing bench press. Uh huh. It's six, right? pretty good because he's just starting and he's been working out but he hasn't done the bench press so it's kind of like you got to get a feel for it yeah <laughs>